Trump lawyer, hints at a First Amendment defense in the January 6th case. Some legal experts are dubious. The legal team of former President Donald Trump has described his indictment in the special counsel's 2020 election interference investigation as an infringement on his right to free speech. Trump's lawyers have argued that the Justice Department is criminalizing the First Amendment. However, experts contest this, stating that the First Amendment claims hold little legal merit, especially given the range of actions Trump and his allies purportedly took that prosecutors claim transformed speech into action in an attempt to overturn the election. These actions allegedly include enlisting fake electors in seven key states won by Joe Biden to falsely represent themselves as legitimate electors, attempting to use the investigative power of the Justice Department to launch fake election fraud investigations, and pressuring Vice President Mike Pence to interfere with the ceremonial vote count before Congress in January 6, 2021. Trump's defense may also focus on the assertion that he genuinely believed in his unfounded election fraud claims. However, the indictment evidences that Trump was reputedly informed by his close confidants that his claims were baseless and his efforts to undermine the election were misguided. The case will be overseen by United States District Judge Tanya Chutkin, who is anticipated to allow the defense to raise First Amendment arguments and let a jury determine the boundary between acceptable speech and illegal action. Thanks for joining us today and for staying to the end of this detailed analysis about former President Donald Trump's legal battle. If you found this content valuable, please hit that like button. It really helps us to continue delivering such content. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more clarity on important news like this. We appreciate your time and engagement.